So in order to make this short video today, you're looking for how to make coffee with a coffee pot. And it may seem obvious to some of you, but I still, um, people ask me questions, well, how, how are you making your coffee? What are you using? It's, it's delicious. I use a coffee pot. I don't use a Keurig. I don't use a coffee maker. I don't go to Dunkin' Donuts. I don't go to Starbucks. I still make coffee in a coffee pot. Um, this is a Farberware. It's a you know a plug-in. It's a percolator. I love this coffee pot. And believe me when I tell you, for thirty something years, I've been making coffee in a coffee pot. And so I thought today, well, maybe a lot of people are wondering, you know, how to make coffee in a coffee pot, right? It's kind of like a dying art. So I thought I'd just you know put this little video together to you know answer that question. Um, so obviously you need a coffee pot. You need, I mean, my all-time favorite, chock full of nuts. It's all I use. And it used to be, and this is going to show you how old I am. For those of you that don't know what this is, it's a coffee scoop. And it used to come in every can of coffee that you used to get. Um, chock full of nuts was the, the longest um, company that, I mean, I've probably had this scoop for, I don't know, 30 years, believe it or not. I cherish this. But if you don't have a scoop, I'm sure you have a set of tablespoons, and for every one scoop, it's two tablespoons. Okay, so if you're watching this today and you don't have a scoop, it's two tablespoons per scoop. And what I do, uh, this is a 12 cup. You can get smaller ones. This is probably about $69.99. Um, I can even show you a site to get cash back on this, like, I don't know, seven, eight percent cash back, which is great, which if you're interested, you know, I'll leave a comment below. But anyway, so this is 12 cups, right? So you don't have to make 12 cups, six cups, four cups, whatever. It's marked on the inside. So what you do is take all this stuff out, okay? This is your basket. This is your little stem. Um, and inside it's marked, okay? So usually, you know, for us, um, I might make six, eight cups of coffee in the morning. It's, um, you fill with the water. It's very simple. You fill it with the water. You put the basket in. If you have a scoop, you use a scoop. Now the ratio is, if you like just regular coffee, and depending on where you are and what cup of, um, what kind of water you have, for every, like if I do eight, it's usually four scoops but I like it stronger, okay? So if I'm gonna make eight cups of coffee, I'm gonna make maybe five or six scoops and try it out. You, you can, you know, regulate it as you like. Um, so what you do, I mean, it's so simple, you scoop, right? Put your little finger over this and you fill it, okay? With the amount of coffee that you want. And then you put this little cover on, nice and even. You put this on, you plug it in. It's that simple. And if you think $69.99 is a lot of money for a coffee pot, I know plenty of you are going to Starbucks and Dunkin's and you are paying more than that in a month if you figure that out. This takes no time to do. It perks for like, if you're making eight cups, eight minutes. You plug it in, it's ready to go. It's a great way to make a nice, delicious cup of coffee. On Sundays, I sprinkle a little cinnamon on top. It is delicious. So enjoy, I hope this helped. Um, any comments, any questions, leave them below. And this is Lisa Sama. Bye-bye.